Good morning, everybody. We're out here, about to make our first test of the day on the old raft. Make sure that doesn't get tangled up anywhere. It's gonna be 70 degrees today, which is amazing. Shouldn't be too, too windy, though I do think it'll be breezy. And we have gear for trout, panfish, and whatever else feels like biting, basically. You guys missed it, I had a fish on the line and he jumped and threw my hook. Well, hopefully I can do that again. Looks like we caught a trout, finally, after Trout or so. After all day, it's a nice feeling. I think we've been out here since uh, 8 30, and it's 11 58. So, but I'll stay out here for a little bit longer and see if we can't catch any more. So, stay tuned. The one thing I hate about spinners is that half the time you cast them and then they hit the water and they do this. Easy to fix, but if you have a cast that looks like that, then it's not going to catch any fish because the hook is on the line. So. Okay. Is a little bit better. Oh man, I can't wait till we move. I'm gonna live. I'm gonna live right next to this lake, so be able to fish more frequently. Right now, the thing that holds me back is it takes about half an hour to get the boat ready. You can only fish this place by boat. 
Got another one. Feels a little bit bigger. At least the uh, GoPro's already going this time. <laughs> guys nicer I would say 12 maybe 12 in one of the most important things when handling trout is to remember to wet your hands before you handle them if you don't plan on keeping them Let's see if I can catch one more before I dip out so all of these fish that I've just caught, all two of them, uh, have been on a really slow... Super slow retrieve. That's a good cast right there, that's about a foot off the shore. Just a slow retrieve, make sure that the blade is spinning, you'll be able to feel the tension. Slow retrieve. And we got a fish. No shit, we got a fish. It's our fourth fish that we've hooked into today, ladies and gentlemen. Oh. Fourth fish. Give him a drink. Give him a drink. It's another maybe nine to 10 inch fish. And he got unhooked on his own. He's right back in the water. What do you guys think? Can we, can we catch another one? You guys can even see where I just counts right there, but. The issue is if I try to move my feet in this little boat, I'll lose balance and I'll eat my feet. I don't want to eat my feet. All right. More in front of us. I have some extra line, let it sink. fish a, a spot enough and then you finally figure out what the fish want and how they want it and you just keep doing that and you'll keep catching fish and that's just how fishing is nice fish i was gonna take some home i might take this guy but uh i'm not trying to take any home you good buddy oh you might need a little bit of reviving Oh, there he goes. All right. Ah, oh, I got a bite. Jeez. Last, 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 last cast. Oh. Okay, sink. Hopefully there's nothing on the end of it. I have to go to the bathroom so bad. Gotta be the last one, so. All right, here we go. <sighs> Dare I say it? Oh, 
Okay. This is absolutely my last cast. Last cast. Well, that's all for today, folks. If you liked the video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like it, where I suck at fishing, and then all of a sudden I catch five fish in a row, uh, feel free to subscribe. Um, <clears throat> other than that, I don't have much to say. Um, it's springtime. Fishing is getting better. We'll be able to catch more kinds of fish. Really looking forward to it. So again, if you want to see more videos like this, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.